Hi sewing friends, welcome to my sewing room. My name is Beth and if you're new, welcome. Today I'm taking eight cotton shirts, making a quilt. Let's get started. My husband was cleaning out his closet and he was getting rid of these cotton shirts and I could not resist taking eight of the shirts and seeing if I could get a quilt out of them. So it turns out I have four that are pretty light colored and four that are darker colored. The green one's not really dark, but um, you know, it's kind of medium dark. So I'm gonna use that green also. And then there was one lighter color that I did not use at all. Now the first thing I need to do is I'm going to cut off all of the collars and the cuffs. Next thing I did was I went and removed the sleeve, just cutting right along the um, seam line there. And then I will cut along the inside of the sleeve and open this up and I'll have one larger piece of fabric that I can use to cut the pieces I'll need for my quilt blocks. I'll be making a quilt block called the Grecian Square and I need a light fabric and a dark fabric and I folded my sleeve in half right along the stripe and I will be cutting first off I'll cut some strips two and a half inch strips and I'll leave down in the description box what you will need for this quilt block you'll need um, some two and a half inch by four and a half inch pieces you'll need um, two squares from each fabric that are five inches and then one square from the dark that's four and a half inches. Using my five inch squares to make half square triangles, I need two light and two dark. I'll draw a line down the middle diagonally and then I'll sew on either side of my line and I'll trim my half square triangles to four and a half inches. So I should have four half square triangles for each block when I'm done. I'll be using my 
little rectangles here, two and a half by four and a half inch. I need four of each dark and four light. I'll put them together and then I'll be all ready to put this block together. I sewed my little pieces together in rows and then I put the rows all together and my Grecian square was complete. This block turned out to be lighter than my other blocks because of that light green, but I think it gave the quilt some variety and I really liked the way it turned out. I wasn't sure what I would think, but I liked it. And then of course, there's always the uh, running out of bobbin thread, so I had to fill up my bobbin to keep going on this little quilt. I was able to squeeze eight blocks out of each shirt, so I was able to make 32 blocks. My blocks measure 12 and a half inches, and so the quilt I'm able to make is a five by six quilt, which really only requires 30 blocks. 
So with these eight shirts, I was able to get what I needed for a nice size quilt. And of course, if I want to make it bigger, I can find some more shirts, I'm sure. <laughs> so I sat down, I pulled off all my buttons, and then I'll be ready to add these to a fun little pillow in my future. This was nice, quiet evening work when I was all done sewing. So thanks for joining me today, and I'll see you next time. Thank you.